Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. This is All In with MJ Hawaii. If you did not subscribe yet to my channel, please click down below to receive a notification to watch more upcoming interesting videos. Today we are going to explore the capital of Georgia called Belize. Belize is the capital of the country of Georgia. It is cobblestone old town reflects a long complicated history with periods under Persian and Russian rule. It is diverse architecture encompasses Eastern Orthodox churches, ornate art, Novu buildings, and Soviet modernist structures. Looming over it all are Narikala, a reconstructed 4th century fortress, and Kartlis Deda, an iconic statue of the Mother of Georgia. The Republic of Georgia is an autonomous mountainous state in the Caucasus region. At the boundary between Europe and Asia, whether Georgia is in Europe or Asia, is dependent on many factors such as the global alliances, citizen passion, and cultural influence. Georgia practices a representative parliamentary democracy with a unitary semi-presidential system, and its citizens speak the Georgian language. The capital city, also the most populous city in Georgia, is Tbilisi. The entire country boasts a population of roughly 4 million people. Historically, Georgia has been under different successive European and Asian rule for centuries, a factor that contributes to its dual identity. And now we are heading to Georgian National Museum. The Georgian National Museum unifies a several leading museums in Georgia. It was established within the framework of structure institutional and legal reforms aimed at the modernizing the management of the institution united within this network and at the coordinating research and educational activities since the formation of December 30, 2004. The museum has been directed by the Professor David Lord Skipadensi. The major highlight of the impressive National Museum is the basement archaeological treasury displaying a wealth of pre-Christian gold, silver, and precious stone work from burials in Georgia. Going back to the 3rd millennium BC, most stunning are the fabulous detailed gold ornaments from Colchis, Western Georgia. On the top floor, the Museum of Soviet Occupation has copious detail on Soviet repression and local resistance to it. On the ground floor are exhibits from the Manisi, the archaeological site in Georgia, whose 1.8 million year old hominid skull are writing the study of early European humanity. We are now here in Kakheti, the wine capital of Georgia. Kakheti is the most important wine region in Georgia, in quantitative, qualitative, and even historic terms. Almost three quarters of country's wine grapes are grown here on land that has been used for viticulture for thousands of years. In June 2013, when Russia lifted its seven-year ban on Georgian wine imports, the first wine across the border were from Kakheti wineries. Kakheti is the home to some of the oldest human habitation in the entire Caucasus region, and archaeological findings have suggested that wine has been produced here for several thousand years. The region's strong relationship with wine and vine was captured in Georgia's famous hymn, Thou art a vineyard, written in the 12th century by Demetrius I, a king known for his writing and poetry. During his time at the David Gereya Monastery in southern Kakheri, very close to Georgian border with Azerbaijan, Demetrius dedicated the work to the region's fertility and it remains important part of Georgian heritage.
Broadway. Oh my. The police traffic. Thank you guys for watching Exploring Georgia. Please don't forget to subscribe and click down below for more upcoming interesting videos.